Hello YouTubers. Well old fat boy and everybody is out of energy. This is where we're at now. The tree has got to come over the top. They're cut off at the bottom. If you looked at the shorts, you saw a short with a big stump going back down. I hope it was in there. And me like a dummy, I've forgotten my tripod. There's an adapter that goes on top of here. So I am just going to kind of balance it in amongst things because I might have to go help. So he is now winching that up over. I think you saw on some of the other ones that's sitting on a root ball. That log there is um, just about all the way cut. That one there is cut. That's a 16.6. It's working good, just the way they wanted it to. And that ain't no little log. He might want to just back up. Look at it sawing through that. Look at it sawing through that stump. Got a limb over there that needs to come off, but look at it just cutting through that stump there. That's neat. We got this one to do, that one up there, I don't know if you can see the chain over there dangling. But somewhere along the line that root ball is going to fall back. We got a feeling after it gets that second one up there it's going to fall back down in there. Now if you go to the shorts, there's a lot of shorts on this, so go to my channel and go to the shorts. The um, three stumps down there, which are these three trees here, when that big root ball went back in, I think I got it on video, I don't know. I'd have videoed more, except for I've been working. Look at that, that's a pretty nice straight log. That's about eight feet in diameter. Oh, did I, I would never tell, lie to you guys. It's only six feet in diameter. That's just a nice saw log there. Once that comes down, gets clear, then we're gonna go over and hook up on that one. Oh, he's just backing up now. All right, that's good. Hey, can you come work the camera? Can you come work the camera? Just, just aim it at anything that you'd like to see. We got a new, we got, huh? Oh, you want to get that? I would just leave the red chain on there. Well, maybe this won't be out too bad after all. No, leave that one on there in case we got to yank it out. You can connect it here. Now we got to put this in neutral. Now care. This is real live time. We're going for that one on the other side. He'll have that hooked in a minute. What we got now, which is making it better, is we're pushed up against a tree. We put a piece of busted up wood on there so it won't get hurt uh, I got to see where the um... you got it other way oh that's a rat's nest but that's what we got to live with nah just pull it We'll get the rat's nest later. Did that other one have much pull? Like I said, this old winch thing we made comes in handy. All the accoutrements up there. I'm gonna get back so we can see what happens. This, this one here is a little bit bigger, I think. Tug of war. Look at it coming out. It's like we planned it. And I'm sure that's going to cut through there too. That winch isn't even straining. The winch is 20,000 pounds single pull. So that's what it's, it might not be pulling that much right now, but it has the ability to pull that much. And it's just going on up the street. I hope you guys like this. I'm sure there was a hundred different ways. All the dangerous stuff 
we didn't film. I didn't have much time for filming because we were just busy. This was a lot of, lot more work than. Uh, we knew it was going to be a lot of work. We still got the ones at the other side of this place. But pretty soon, that's going to be out. Then I think we're going to hook that big one. Or maybe maybe we'll hook this one here. Probably be best to hook that one. Whatever which one he wants. Don't matter. We got a few, few limmers there that we got to take off. We got a lot of... Um, got a lot of... Uh, this all firewood up there. These are saw logs up there. We got a couple logs on there right now. Did you get dizzy just then? Sorry about that. Sometimes this old brain forgets. That root stump there is probably 12 feet high up there at the top. Look at that thing. Wouldn't want that on my sawmill. That thing is so full of mud. Needs a pressure washer. Now that's still pretty long because this piece here from here to here is 17 foot, 16.6. Let's see what happens when this comes off. We might have a good crash. He might not be able to be pulling it. It's a little stickier here than we thought. Yeah, he's spinning. He's going to have to go up against that tree again. He ain't going nowhere. He's dreaming. That's the first time he's really used the winch. Oh, he's going to dig it down in. He'd be better off going against the tree. It's got a it's got a foot on the front so it goes down in. That that might be digging in now. There, right, here it comes. Sorry about the sun. The sun is going down. We are at the stump. Here it comes. Maybe that'll knock that other one off. That would be nice. It's cracking. Oh man, I wish that would have rolled that way. Still going. If we get it off to the end. Hear it squeaking? I didn't, we ain't gaining nothing. I, I thought maybe we could gain and have it flip over the other side, but it doesn't look that way. We might have to clean up now before we get the cable out for the other one. You got about 10 more feet. Oh, you're hitting the other tree. All right, what do you want to do next? Grab the big one? Hold on a second, we gotta figure out what we're doing. Maybe we're de, de lemon. Oh. Cut a few of these branches off. Good idea. tree there so we got to stop Cut it off here, we're gonna junk that. That ain't no good. You wanna go for the big one now, right? 
the real big one, you're gonna need to go, hey, let the, to pull that out, you're gonna have to butt up against this tree. Sorry about this. Need a cameraman. Uh, ouch. That old chain, old thing started twisting. Kenny, cameraman. Yeah, I'll hook it up. You'll hook it up? Okay. He's going to have to go against that tree up there to pull this one out, I think. I thought we could get that just over there, but we didn't. Huh? Let's let's put this tree here underneath this cable. Let's see if we can't get this thing to slide up onto that. It would help it out a whole lot. Yeah, I think that's good. He's good. Start pulling. I think he's gonna have to butt up against that tree. I might be wrong. I do wrong real good. But I think he's gonna, yeah. <laughs> I thought he was gonna have to butt up against that tree. You ain't even budging it. So now he's got to let the cable out and You want to push against the stump? a little muddier here than we thought we've had some rains you saw the uh, steam show last weekend no that was the weekend before anyhow it's kind of wet here but if we got that that i-beam there if he sinks that into that i-beam right there it'd be all right i think you're good He's not used to one of these that turns like this either. It's like his first day on a job here. No, no, up, back up, up. Trying to get, now we got some push or pull. Now let's see what we can do. If not, we'll go against a tree. I thought he was going to have to go against a tree anyway. All right. Always exciting. Now he's pushing the whole tree back in there. <laughs> I thought he was going to have to stay on that tree. No, maybe it's starting to come now a little bit. Nope. That log weighs some pounds, guys. He's going to have to go up and butt it up against the tree. I thought he was going to stay against the tree. Like I said, he's never used the winch before. Once it gets against that tree... Hey! Hey! Got limbs up there. Now you'll pull.
It's not fast. I'll take you down there when we get to the good stuff. All right, here we go. Look at that. It ain't even giving it a trouble. I tried to tell me you're going to have to be on that on that thing, but and we still got that one over there. We're going to have to winch that off to that side. And the roller down there I put in there seems to be working pretty good. That's a lot of log, guys. That will make a big chicken coop. Uh oh, about ready to run out of my roller, but it might go down onto the second roller. Yeah, it went down on the second roller, but it's still staying off. Actually, we should have been pulled this from below, but they kind of turn around the way they want to get around anyway. That log there is 33 feet, give or take 10 feet. No, it's 33 feet. Think about that. I can put that on that new sawmill and saw it all in one cut without a problem. That would be the show. But I can't get it from here to home being 33 feet. I don't have anything long enough to haul it. Coming right out of there, ain't it? I'd sure like to get that over and have that flop down while I still got this video. We only got about 10 minutes left. You know this goes out at 30 minutes. So I'm not sure if I'm going to get it. I did put a hot battery in there though. I always put a hot battery in. Some of them like to work and some of them don't like to work. He's still alright up here. It's, it's grunting and popping. I don't know if the old Bobcat's going to pick that one up or not. I think we'll leave that there. This is all poison ivy and I don't do poison ivy too good. Oh man. You got it? Okay. Now if we can push that off of there. Hey, can you hold the camera for a minute? I'm gonna leave you in charge of the camera. I'm gonna wind that thing up. that other log butt back up here and see if we can't pull that one off the stump and let it roll let the stump go back okay we ain't got much time at 30 minutes it goes out automatically so
start another one because it's going to go off in a yeah, we're still at 21. I think we'll stop at 21. You guys can come back and watch the next one. We're going to go around the other side and pull this off, which will be on the next movie, and then pull that big one up there, and then we're going to start loading these things. So that's where it is. Hit the like button, subscribe button, and if you want to see the next story in this, stop back. Over and out.